Shoulder surfing! Hang ten, dude! Has actually nothing to do with the actual art of surfing. Shoulder surfing is when you look over people's shoulders, figuratively and literally, and look at what they're doing. You're looking at their private data. Basically, you're snooping over people's shoulders and looking at, it doesn't have to be their shoulders, could be around their shoulders, at their information. This is especially common in airports and coffee shops. So uh, I used to have to fly out of Reagan International many times out of D.C., Reagan International is one of the favorite places for senators, congressmen, people from the Pentagon, other federal officials. And you'd be amazed at how many people who are supposed to know better are working on things in public that they shouldn't be working on. I guess they like to show off what they have or whatever. I don't know. But you can see a lot. In fact, if you just keep your eyes open in an airport, you can see a lot of information that people really don't want other people to see, but yet they're working on it out there. Coffee shops are another great example. In fact, the next time you find yourself in a coffee shop or in the airport, stop and just start looking around. You'd be amazed at what you can find out and what you can see. So, how do you prevent yourself from being a victim of shoulder surfing? One, try keeping your back to the wall. It's really hard to see from behind if there's a wall back there. It's kind of hard to get back there if you're against the wall. Two, you can use a filter over the screen. What this does is it prevents people from seeing from the side. Now, the danger of using a filter over the screen is that you are screaming, hey, I've got stuff on my computer that's worth seeing. So if you weren't a target before, you will be now. Also, you really shouldn't confront somebody if you think they're shoulder surfing. I know that kind of sounds odd, but you really don't want to confront them. Instead, you just close your laptop lid or you just put your phone down they get the hint and they move on. And of course, the best way to prevent shoulder surfing, the number one way to prevent it, is simply don't work on your private stuff in public places. And that will help keep your private information private. In the next video, we're going to take a look at tailgating. And I don't mean the fun type.